Welcome back, Smokestacks, to another episode of Waiting to Inhale. I'm your host, KK, and I got a dope unboxing episode for you today. So go ahead and make sure you subscribe to the channel right now if you haven't already, and turn your notifications on. Leave a comment, let me know you are here, and go ahead and like this video. And like a good joint, go ahead and pass this. So let's get into the unboxing. As you see here, I have the raw perspector. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this up, take a look at it and uh, see what's inside and see what use it will have in my life. <laughs> now, I got this from a local dispensary here in Florida, but any decent dispensary should have them. So let's get this bad boy open. Now, I'm gonna be honest with you, I bought the last one they had available um, so it's actually on display and they put it in the box for me. So they must be pretty good because it was the last one available. So that should tell you something. So already I got a few pieces here. All right. So it looks like it came in three main pieces. I have what looks to be a USB charger and this if i'm not mistaken is just a metal plate so that way if you don't have a tray which you should definitely have a tray if you're a real stoner but if you don't have a tray you could sit your perspector on this so that's pretty cool and it's just a little metal piece and okay we have the perspector here and it is magnetized and felt so if you have like a glass tray or a metal tray that you don't want to scrape up, it won't scrape it, but it's magnetized. So that's awesome, which I love that about uh, raw products, even their ashtray magnetized. So that's pretty awesome. Let me get this plastic off here. And that seems to be protecting our light and our magnifier. So the magnifying glass here, it gives you three times magnification and five times magnification. And we have a little flexible arm here, so you could do, put this any old type of way if you need to. I like that, you know what I'm saying? A little flexible. And let's see, let's use the light. So it's hard to sell right now because I have this lighting here, but it looks like we have a cool little LED light, which is great because that's the best light when you're looking at like your, your material and checking out the nice little crystals and hairs on it. So that LED light is hella useful. And it looks like it has a black light on it as well. So that is pretty cool. That will let you see if there's like, I don't know, what the fuck? I don't know really what you would need a black light for your for your cannabis for, but I'm sure it'll do something cool to it. When I find out, I'll let you know. <laughs> and if you know, go ahead and drop it in the comments and tell me why you would want to use a black light on your material. Learn me something. So this is pretty cool. I like this. And it just flips with a little switch of a button. And the light is fairly bright. Let's take a look at something under our magnifying glass. Oh, I like that. Oh, that is way cool. Oh man, I feel hella sciency and shit looking at it under the magnifying glass. <laughs> this is pretty handy though. I like this. This is cool. And it looks like there's little compartments here to put things. You can put your poker there. It looks like a clipper lighter would fit there. And let's see, sit your papers there. That's dope. I'm already a fan of this. This is really cool. I like it. Let's use it. <laughs> All right, where do we start? First off, I feel like since it has the light on here, I would not be doing this justice if I didn't roll up in the dark. So I'm about to roll up in the dark. So now that the vibe is set, let's roll up. 
this is so cool. So there's like no excuse to having to turn a light on when you're watching a movie or watching TV at night. This is cool too, the fact that you can scrape your material straight up to the edge of the prospector. Light. Again, I'm not too sure why you would want to use the black light, but it does look cool. So if you know why, and there's a cool scientific or even non-scientific reason why, let me know. And now I have somewhere to sit my joint in case I was going to roll some more. So far, I like it. So far, I'm really rocking with this. I like it a lot, actually. I would recommend you get this. This is a really good buy. I'm gonna use it some more. Obviously, this is my first time ever using it, so I'm gonna get used to it. But so far, I can already see how this is gonna enhance my rolling capability. Okay, maybe not, okay. Maybe not enhance my rolling capabilities, but it is gonna add another layer of experience and just make it convenient when I'm rolling up in the dark or at night or something. And the cool thing, now that I'm thinking about it, it's lightweight. So I could easily just throw this in a book bag or something and take it with me on the go. Especially if you know you're gonna be with your friends somewhere that's gonna be dark and you know you wanna roll up. I'm not saying you should take this to like a club or anything, but it would be useful. <laughs> so this is pretty cool. I would definitely recommend this. You can probably find it at a local smoke shop near you. I definitely recommend buying it from a smoke shop directly, not getting it online or like Amazon or anything like that, because then you run the risk of getting a fake. You definitely don't want that. So if I were you, I would go ahead and get to a local smoke shop, one that typically sells raw products because they tend to have um, some of the newer things that raw brings out and even some of the older things that are just awesome as hell. So definitely go to a smoke shop to get this. Unfortunately, you can't buy it on the raw website. You can only buy it from a smoke shop or dispensary. Um, again, watch out for the fakes, but this is really fire. I'm enjoying it. I'm recommending it. I think you should get it if you have a chance to get it, especially if you're, a, if you're a true stoner, this is like top tier. If you smoke every now and again, 
it's probably not gonna be worth the 30, 40, 50 bucks, depending on where you get it from, to get this. Um, for me, hella worth it, and I'm super glad I grabbed it, so awesome. If you have a perspective and you love using it, and you know why the heck the black light is there, then please drop a comment and let me know so I know what's going on here. And if you don't have one, you should definitely go get one. Thank you so much for tuning into this unboxing. I really appreciate it. Make sure you go ahead and drop a comment. Let me know you were here. Like this video and like a good joint, share and pass this along. And of course, subscribe to the channel, especially if you're wanting to see more dope content about cannabis coming from a cool ass black woman, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate you. I hope you enjoy your week. I hope you enjoy your day. But more importantly, I hope you enjoy your next smoke. This has been another episode of Waiting to Inhale.